Hey there, Tubbies. Welcome back to 2230. If you're enjoying this content and want to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an upload. We love creating content for you and appreciate your support. Let's get started. In a heart-wrenching incident that has shaken the nation, Odisha, a state in India, witnessed a horrific train collision that claimed the lives of at least 233 people, leaving 900 injured. The calamity occurred on a fateful Friday, forever etched in the memories of those affected. The collision involved two passenger trains, the Hara Superfast Express and the Coromandel Express, triggering a race against time to rescue survivors amidst the wreckage. As news of the tragedy spread, video footage emerged, capturing the gut-wrenching scenes at the crash site. Rescuers, driven by sheer determination, defied danger as they climbed through the mangled remains of the trains in a desperate attempt to find survivors. Passengers, overwhelmed by shock and grief, called out for help and sobbed amidst the wreckage, their voices a poignant reminder of the human toll this disaster had taken. The magnitude of the horror was best captured through the words of an eyewitness, who spoke with Reuters. I was there at the site, and I can see blood, broken limbs, and people dying around me, they recounted over the phone. The weight of their words resonated, painting a vivid picture of the anguish and despair that unfolded at the crash site. While the nation grappled with the shock of the tragedy, authorities struggled to provide clear answers. Conflicting accounts emerged, leaving questions about which train derailed first and became entangled with the other. As the nation mourned the lives lost, investigations began to shed light on the cause of this catastrophic event. The people demanded answers, seeking closure and accountability. Amidst the chaos and despair, the human spirit rose to the occasion. An extensive search and rescue operation unfolded, bringing together hundreds of brave firefighters, police officers, and sniffer dogs. Their tireless efforts, driven by a collective determination to save lives, stood as a testament to the indomitable spirit of humanity in the face of adversity. The tragedy in Edissa also showcased the power of unity and compassion. In an inspiring display of solidarity, hundreds of young people lined up outside a government hospital in the town of Soro, eager to donate blood. Their selflessness and willingness to support their fellow citizens brought a glimmer of hope in the darkest of times. As the nation grappled with the enormity of the loss, Edissa's chief minister, Naveen Patnaik, declared a day of state mourning on June 3, as a mark of respect for the victims. The day served as a solemn reminder of the fragility of life and the need for continued efforts to enhance safety in India's railway system. The tragic train collision in Edissa has left an indelible mark on the nation, serving as a somber reminder of the importance of safety in public transportation. As the authorities work to unravel the causes behind the disaster, let us remember the lives lost and the heroes who stepped forward in the face of danger. May this tragedy spur renewed efforts to ensure the well-being of all those who rely on the railways and foster a collective commitment to prevent such calamities in the future. Thanks for tuning in to this response video. If you want to stay up to date on the latest reactions and responses, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And as always, I love reading your comments and feedback. Once again thank you for viewing and I hope to see you on the next video.